What's up YouTube? This is your boy King Denix and today I'm gonna give you tips on how to stand out from other photographers and be the only one. Stay tuned. So the first tip I'm gonna teach you is learn your equipment. People think when they buy expensive gear, the gear is actually gonna do the job for them. But at the end of the day, you have to know how to use your equipment, or else you'll be rated as an amateur. You have to practice your equipment and uh, learn from other photographers, follow other photographers, uh, research on the internet how to use that specific equipment that you have. At the end of the day, the camera is just a tool. What you do with it? that's the skill what you do with it that's art you're not gonna go and buy an, an expensive camera a9 and expect to take very nice picture and you don't even understand what shutter speed is uh, what aperture is what a lens is you have to practice your equipment know how to use your equipment understand its pros and cons so you can take very beautiful pictures and also be rated as a professional photographer tip number two Get inspiration from other photographers, follow other photographers, uh, learn how they master their craft. Follow them on social media, Facebook, Instagram, even on YouTube. Some photographers now do vlogs. Following other photographers will also teach you uh, how to overcome other challenges when it comes to photography. You will also learn how to direct models. You have to understand how the photography industry works. And the only way to know that you have to follow people that have been doing it for years. Tip number three, let people criticize your work. Let people rate your work. Put your work out there. Get a group of friends, people that you know that love your work and use those people to rate your work. The only way to avoid being pissed or pissing people off is to do nothing at all. So this is photography, you all get an opposing side. Let people criticize your work. Never be afraid of people telling you that they don't like your pictures because the skin is too red, they don't like your pictures because the background is too blurry. Before I can even post anything, I take my work out there, send it to people and say, what do you think? If they say the skin is too red, I have to adjust it. If they say, no, the composition is bad, I have to adjust everything. So never be afraid of being rated. Even if your work is bad, that means you have to try better next time. Never be afraid of failing. Failure is the only way forward. So tip number four is to join photography communities. That's where you're going to get the best ratings for your photos, uh, for your work. And that's where you're going to meet other international photographers. When it comes to getting professional ratings, when it comes to getting professional advice for free. So joining also community photographers is going to help you learn from other photographers and also get to communicate with them and also get to ask questions for free. Life is good. Ain't got no worries. Niggas wanna roll with me and girls wanna ride on a day. Yeah, we do it all day. All day, all day, all day. Yeah, we do it all day.